Well, a very universal statement. Indigents and indulgents are the true extremes of wretchedness. And both are equally unnatural and the result of the mental disorder of the man. But a man can not be rightly conditioned unless he is healthy, happy and prosperous being and his health, happiness and prosperity are as a result of the harmonious adjustment of the inner with the outer, man with his surroundings. I can explain this complicated statement in a very simple way. As a man thinks, so he speaks, that way he acts, and the way he repeatedly acts, it becomes his habits, and that habits gravitate into his environment and surroundings. So if a man is really willing to be healthy, his mind should be fully saturated with health consciousness attitude. And then he must understand the laws of health, how health can be attained. And the clue is very simple. He has to have plenty of fresh air, he should drink a lot of water, he should have healthy diet, he should have a very sound sleep, and he should have a lot of exposure of the solar radiation, which is the source of vitamin D and source of life. Dear friends, and his mind should be very peaceful and serene. That is the clue of healthy, healthy life. If the mind is cheerful and he is laughing often much, as said Ralph to Emerson, he will be really a successful person because health is everything. People say character is everything, wealth is little, and health is not that important, but I just reverse everything. Health is everything, and to maintain a sound physical health, you should have pure, pure mind, because only pure mind can give you a serene life, a calm life, a unperturbed, undisturbed, untrumpeted state of mind. If you really deal in the ocean of truth, we need a bay beyond the tempest, then only will be peaceful. And then you will live more than 100 years, guaranteed. Because care kills the cat. If you are always invaded by evil thoughts, greed, anger, hatred, jealousy, cynicism, you will never be resting, you will be restless. Because your evil will eat away you. It is a demon which can destroy you. Nobody can escape the result of his evil thought, what an action. So, number one. If you want to be healthy, be peaceful, be serene, be calm, be very honest. And your foundation of life should be based on truth, justice, peace, love and non-violence, kindness, compassion, honesty, integrity, humility, generosity, cooperation, sympathy, understanding, keen sense of justice, unwavering courage, complete discipline in the state of mind, always decisive, always bold and brave. Then only you can be very comfortable and peaceful in life and enjoy very sound physical health. So health is completed. Happiness. Happiness also emerge because you have abundance and opulence of all the resources on this earth. So you are bound to be happy and healthy, my friends. And there is a progress and prosperity because day by day in every way you are going to grow larger and larger and better and better a very healthy, happy and progressive, peaceful human being. So now the bottom line. <laughs> a man is not rightly conditioned unless he is healthy, happy, peaceful and progressive. And his health, happiness, peace and progressiveness is a result of the harmless adjustment of the inner with the outer, the man with his surroundings. Thank you viewers.